And anybody who has committed their life to working and providing for their loved ones, retirement is supposed to be, you know, time to enjoy life. This is so important, and we were talking about this earlier on in the show, a shocking new study revealing that one-third of Americans actually have no retirement savings. Well, whether you are closing in on retirement or you have a lot of years left on the journey, have no fear because we have the man that is going to fill you in here today live in the studio here on CT Style, Michael Lairhaupt. He is the CEO and of Strategies for Retirement. Thank you so much for joining us here today on Welcome. the show, Michael. Uh, this is great. You have three locations right here in Connecticut. Correct. But I, I'm sure a question that you get asked quite often, when is the best time to start investing? Well, look, the obvious answer is as soon as you can, mm -hmm. right? And especially if you're working for a company with a 401k or, or a program that matches the money. That's free wanna, money, right? It's free money. You want to put as much as you can away. Nothing better than, th than free money. Exactly. But the, the real critical part, though, is being able to hold on to what you put away. Mm. There's nothing worse than putting money away and then having a market crash like 2008 when you open your 401k statement and it turns into a 201k. And uh, that's very important because you talk about uh, two different buckets uh, in investing. There's more aggressive and then there's more conservative. Correct. And typically the older you get, you know, there's, there's two buckets. There's a risky bucket and a safe bucket. And the strategy really is that the older you get, the more you want to the more you want to start shifting some money into the safe bucket and protect it and then in the risk bucket only what you can afford to you know play the market with and uh, one of the things that we were talking about before the segment and really interesting it's it, it's so critical uh, with losses to your portfolio at, uh, over the age of 50 this could be uh, really really uh, not a good thing well it, 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 it is catastrophic mm -hmm. and the reason I say that is you when you're young you have time to recover from a market loss. Mm -hmm. Many people don't know, you know, if you do the math, if you lose 50% in a market loss, you literally have to make 100% back to get back to where you are. So most people in 2008 took five to seven years if they had the stomach to stay in yeah. it to get back to the way they are. You know, when you're 50 and over and you have to start to use this money, you know, in retirement and you need to make it last 30, 35, 40 years, mm -hmm. it's critical then, you know, because you don't have the time or the stomach to recover from those big corrections. Yeah, well, I mean, that's the great thing is that you are, you're helping a lot of people right here in Connecticut yeah. with, with a lot of these problems. And there's actually um, many seminars that are coming up right here in the state of Connecticut. And you can check out uh, the website for a little bit more information. It is safemoneyrs.com. So make sure that you guys head on over there and check that out. Uh, real quick, the three tips and, and goals that you have for all of your clients. Well, so we focus on three things, especially in the safe part of the safe bucket, mm -hmm. so to speak. The first thing is protecting the principal, you know, safety first. The second is getting our clients a reasonable rate of return mm -hmm. at the same, same time, protecting that principal. And the third thing is, you know, investments don't have to be complicated. It can be simple, you know, and we keep it simple and easy for our clients. Especially for money. I, I think you can agree at home. We need it to be simple. Keep it simple for us. Michael, thank you so much for joining us here. You're quite welcome. Today on CT Style, three locations right here in the state, Shelton, Norwalk, and Middletown. Thank you again. And uh, hey, everybody at home, start your engines. Drivers from the